Now one of the Pharisees invited Jesus to dinner with him. So he went to the Pharisee's house and reclined at the table. When a woman who had lived a sinful life in that town learned that Jesus was eating at the Pharisee's house, she brought an alabaster jar of perfume, and as she stood behind him at his feet, weeping, she began to wet his feet with her tears. Then she wiped them with her hair, kissed them, and poured perfume on them. If you were a prophet, you would know the score. that she frequents and the trouble she has been yes you would yes you would now it's a precious oil of worship the perfume of sins forgiven the sweet smell of grace and the fragrance of gratitude How can I ever thank you? The gift is not enough All I can give you are the tears of love If you were a prophet then you'd know the perfume's worth The jar of alabaster holds on all that cost you It, let it spill upon the floor It sell it for a profit Give the proceeds to the poor Yes, he would Yes, he would now It's a precious oil of worship of sins forgiven, the sweet smell of grace and mercy, the fragrance of gratitude. How can I ever thank you? The gift is not enough. All I can give you are the tears of love. Then he turned towards the woman and said to Simon, do you see this woman? I came into your house. You did not give me any water for my feet, but she wet my feet with her tears and wiped them with her hair. You did not give me a kiss, but this woman, from the time I entered, has not stopped kissing my feet. Therefore, I tell you, her many sins have been forgiven, for she loved much. But he who has been forgiven little loves little. Then Jesus said to her, Your sins are forgiven. You claim to give forgiveness. Who do you think you are? You think you're the Messiah, but I think you've gone too far. Yes, I do. Yes, I Gift is 